Huebes delivered the keynote address at the 7th Tuban Gurirap Lecture under the theme How to Harness Technology in Preparing the Maben Youth for the African Continental Free Trade Agreement to Achieve the Africa We Want. In this respect, appropriate educational efforts can yield results in terms of a better quality of workforce. The youth should be considered the key player for the economic and social trans structural transformation of Africa. They are the energy and creativity of the future. She says the creativity, energy and innovation of African youth can be the driving force behind the continent's political, social, cultural and economic transformation as youth in Africa currently represent 30% of the world's young people. 21% of its 1.2 billion people are between the ages of 15 and 24, whereas 42% are younger than 15. It's a huge, huge group. And it's a group that needs to be educated. It's a group that needs to be skilled. It's a group that needs to be given the necessary equipment and the tools to deliver the Africa we want. The Deputy Minister urged panelists at the lecture series that consists mostly of young people to encourage their peers to prepare themselves for the fourth industrial revolution and the advent of artificial intelligence. We need to formulate a comprehensive continental blueprint that will guide us in the artificial intelligence strategy by involving key pan-African institutions by involving the academia, by involving the private and the public sector and by involving you. The Dr. Tiu Ben Gurirap lecture series was introduced in honor of Namibia's first foreign minister and is aimed at informing the general public and stakeholders about contemporary international and national issues. Nat Tangwe Jimmy NBC News, Kiet Mansuap.